Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. If you guys have a BMW now, listen for all the models guys. BMW 1 series, 2, 3, 4 or 5 series guys with the 4 cylinder gasoline engine. This engine is known as N20 guys engine, N20 B20 engine. Uh, and you guys have drivetrain malfunction light, engine light on, car not running right, dying, okay or being uh, noisy, having a noisy timing chain, stay with us guys, we'll explain what causes that, uh, we just dropped the oil pan, we found our problem and that's a weak spot with this engine guys and there is a uh, class action lawsuit going on uh, with BMW also guys. Uh, quick introduction, every single car we get at the shop, including guys this one here, we make at least two to three hundred videos, on the BMWs maybe even more, maybe up to four hundred videos, why we guys do all that, simply because our mission in the shop is to save you guys as much money as we can by teaching you guys how to fix your car for free. So, uh, take advantage guys, please subscribe to the channel, like the video and let us know if you have any questions. Another thing guys, if you need to buy any replacement parts or tools, check out the links in the description of the video below, all that will be shared there for your convenience. That same engine guys has been used in all BMWs, 1 series, 2, 3 series, 4, 5 series guys. If you have a valve uh, engine cover that looks like that, okay, this is the, uh, you can see right here the twin turbo. Uh, engine guys uh, this is known as a four cylinder n20 b20 engine guys uh, and this one has only 87,000 miles it developed that problem now what is happening guys okay i read that people experiencing uh, experience something like that anywhere from 30 to 120 30,000 miles on average but most of them will uh, have that problem around 70 80,000 miles and at 87 we purchased that bmw with that problem guys um, we have the light inside, drivetrain malfunction, we did some research and it said that the weak spot is the timing chain guide. This is guys, a new timing chain guide, we will have the link in the description of the video below. This guide, okay, keeps the chain from going in certain direction. Now, uh, what is happening from what I understand, BMW made it to where it wears out easy and from the heat it's not flexible and it starts falling apart. As a result guys, when that thing falls apart, you will develop slack on the chain and you can skip the timing, jump the timing guys and as a result you may end up needing new engine. In our case we didn't smash the valves, the engine still fine so if you develop something like that, quit it <laughs> like immediately guys, do not drive anymore because there is a chance to actually put a new timing chain and kit and not to worry about it. Now, if you try to drive it, you can jump the timing chain, that engine is expensive, believe me. How we know that from experience. So, we dropped the oil pan guys, we removed the oil pan and what we found inside, our old timing chain guide is in pieces guys. This is it right there. This is inside the oil pan, can you believe it? This piece, okay, it's this piece right there, check it out. Okay, so it's broken guys. Another thing, you can see how wore out it is, completely broken. So uh, it turned into plastic guys, it's not flexible at all. Okay, no flexibility at all. Uh, and the new one, you can see how flexible it is. Okay, you can see how it moves, that's how it should be. Uh, the, this is, um, they have the updated kind, which is supposed to be better. Uh, most of the cars guys that will develop that problem, I, re I, I read it's from uh, before year uh, 2013, March, March 2013, so check your build label. And if it's before March 2013, you definitely guys need to perform that repair before you say bye bye to your engine. The whole video guys about the timing chain replacement, the guides and all that, will be on our channel, Auto Repair guys, this channel guys here as well guys. If you want to see more information, we have two more channels, World Mechanics and Electrical Car Repair Life. Check it out guys, we're constantly pumping videos so we can save you guys as much money as we can. Now, uh, thank you for watching guys, please subscribe to the channel for more videos and see you guys next time.